This this one I will give you. Ah, this uh, this Timothy Adebo case, case versus Adebayo is becoming something else. You know, now we are experiencing corruption at its highest level. All right, good day. My name is Kate the IT the NT the G the K Game Seven. I'm welcoming you on board to G Dynamic TV, home of pure entertainment and out out gist out out akara. Okay, this is about hmm? this is about still uh Amzat are they doing that's the Amzat are they doing the Maya of Elefe Kingdom versus Chief uh sorry I mean Chief Raman are they doing versus Chief uh, uh, uh Amzat Oriomi yeah, are they doing charge to Oriomi to court? Charge to Oriomi to court. He said, mm, you, well, 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 you are, this is defamation of name, defamation of blah, blah, blah. Now, the latest gist about this is that, you know, they, are, they, they were at the high court at Ileife. Hmm? The high court too at Ileife. And there, you could see the lawyer, one of the lawyers, uh, you know, one of the prosecutors um, in, in favor of the Timothy Adegoke family saying, ah, <laughs> what happened was that they were expecting the the supreme uh, the the judge the judge there the judge at the high court you know to just pass some kind of judgment maybe I'm not saying concerning Adido in this case I'm talking about you know for him to pass a kind of judgment of uh, okay maybe instead of the case being struck out the case should be revisited revisited again and then the lawyer said on getting the the <laughs> they said the the judge uh, told them that. He can't do it again. That he has to forward it to another judge. To <laughs> well, this is if you can still remember Timothy Adegoke of blessed memory was murdered in cold blood at 18 hotels belonging to Chief Raman Adedoin, hmm? the Mayor of Ife Kingdom. That was where he was murdered. And a lot has been going on on this, as you know. A lot, even for now, we are not even hearing anything about Badi, the other brother of the deceased. You know, his own was. Yeah, different too. Uh, we saw a video of Adedoyin cursing, uh, cursing him, threatening him with death, and Badi also cursing, uh, calling Chief Raman Adedoyin all sort of names and everything. A lot is just going on about this matter. A lot. And to a, to, to a standpoint, I can boldly tell you that this this is not encouraging at all. They are like, this country, according to the lawyer, according to the lawyer, the lawyer said, this country... <laughs> Yeah, the corruption level in this country is more than what we can actually imagine. And don't forget, just yesterday, I still told you about how Chief Amza Toriyomi, mm, that human rights activist and broadcaster, uh, OAP, he said, he said that he has been attacked severe, severely and severely by those people in opposition. You know, when you say those people in opposition, he's just talking about the, 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 so the, the culprits who were involved in the death of Timothy Adegoki, that MBA student of Obafemi Yawolo University, he said he had a dream that in the dream he saw that a cap got lost and then he told some set of people to look for the cap or else there will be trouble and then he saw a king and he told the king, king this cap must be seen and then they went into a room and were gathering all sort of loads and luggages out and they said they couldn't find the cap and he said they must find the cap. No, according to him he said the cap is just uh, in accordance uh, with uh, Timothy's case. You know, this is uncalled for in a country like Nigeria. I believe this is uncalled for. You know, uh, now, Hamzat he even said the people, he said, and I quote, the people we are facing, <laughs> they are not of flesh and blood. <laughs> they are principalities and powers that, that we are facing. And we, we need to strategize and do some other grand work. Now they are looking forward that the judge, hmm, the judge we actually uh, assign, we, we, we sign. And then assign the, the case to another judge in still Ileife, in another court, in another uh, court in Ileife. And then his words, the lawyer said, okay, so they will get back to us. So that, that's why we have to be patient and see if the judge is going to sign it or not. Oh, this is getting so, so, so heated up, man. This is getting so, so heated up. You know, I don't understand. I did, I did uh, Raman, uh, 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 Raman, Raman said, Amza Toriyomi defamed his name and blah 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 <laughs> this is a country ah god hmm. this is a country where people use power and money to oppress i'm telling you and then the lawyer you know in the, in the video he said he's just so sure that this kind of case that's uh i did doing against uh chief uh, chief amza toriomi so this kind of case 
will be struck out. That he, he said, like he said it emphatically in Yoruba, he said, and I quote, you know, enjoy you, my father, down on on. He said, they are going to all these cases, they are going to strike it out, it's going to be struck out. So they will now have to revisit the one on ground in which they were suspected of, you know, suspected of murdering Timothy Adegok in cold blood. Say so this one there about uh, Yomi defaming Yomi. It's going to be struck out, but that is the final. Now that's the final. They are just trying to play many games, many mind games, but it's not going to work. All right, we hope justice will speak. We hope justice will prevail on behalf of Timothy Adegoki. Don't worry, we'll continue to int you about the matter. Thank you very much. My name is K to the I to the N to the G, the King himself. This is G Dynamic TV. Thank you very much. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you click on the notification bell so you can be notified when we post new content. That's all about Oriomi. Hmm? Oriomi was charged to court. He was sued by the, <laughs> by Ramon Adedoyin, one of the corporates uh, who was allegedly uh, suspected uh, in having something to do with the death of Timothy Adegoki. And then uh, the lawyer in charge of, you know, Ade, uh, Amza, Oriomi's uh, lawyer, Oriomi's lawyer said, this, this case will be struck out. It's just so sure it will be struck out. Because uh, in Yoruba, he said, Kolori Konidi. So it's not something that will be. So they will still have to revisit the bone of contention, which is the murder, you know, the case about the murder of Timothy Adigo.